Hey, what's up everyone? Mark from Mighty Tonka Madness here. Coming to you with another video. As always, if you're watching me on YouTube, don't forget to like and please hit that subscribe button so you can stay up on all my upcoming videos right when they come out. You can set it to send your alert to your phone or wherever you watch YouTube. And without further ado, let's check out what we got here today. Check out these guys. It's a backhoe bonanza. <laughs> Got three different three different models here today. Start out with the with the oldest oldest model. This is the 1970 and 71 backhoe. This was actually from the regular. Tonka line. It wasn't a mighty, even though it's pretty big. Um, you can tell it's 70, 71. Uh, it's Tonka USA decal. That's made from 70 to 73. These tires down here, they say Tonka on them, but they're not white letters. So on the backhoe and these tires in general, uh, 70 and 71 were the letters without the um, without the white letters. So this is a 7071 backhoe. So, and they all kind of work uh, backhoes. They all kind of work the same. Let's push these back a little bit so we can get as far back. Set up the tripod here. So the handle right here, um, it's just black. Black metal. It's not missing the plastic piece. The plastic uh, grip only came on that lever. That one lifts up the entire arm. And of course, the, this one, you push it forward and it pushes out the bucket to dig. And it kind of pulls in the stick and curls the bucket in one motion. Pretty cool little toy. And of course, uh, Spins around, oh, yeah. Spins around on the base. This one's a little, a little funky looking with the six wheels on it. Uh, there was also a crawler version of this type of backhoe. I haven't gotten that one yet. Um, it's actually one of my favorite ones. I've been trying, but it's eluded me so far. So someday uh, that one came out in uh, seventy. Uh, 77 and went to 80 or 81, I forget, the crawler version. But this one, like I said, 70 and 71. This one was made with uh, black letter tires. So it's got the chrome hubcaps. These ones are a little rusty. But what are you going to do? It's, third, it's uh, 50, 53, 52 years old. So pretty cool. This one's in pretty good shape. It's, it's played with, but it's got the little, it's got teeth on the bucket here. But, uh, like I said, you push the, push that lever out, moves the bucket. Pretty cool. Um, this one's got, the cab decals are pretty good, but it's, uh, I had decals down here that are, you're kind of missing, so. Actually, this one may, now that I think about it, this one may be uh, 71 because that's when they came out with the, uh, the vinyl, uh, vinyl stick-on decals, adhesive decals, as opposed to the water transfer. So this one may be a 71, actually, so specifically. But uh, yeah, so that one, it had the same decal over here. It's a caution with the three stripes and three stripes, but they're missing. Pretty common, common to be missing. So let's push this guy off to the side, and let's bring this guy out. Now this one is the a mighty version. Uh, they came out with this version in '83. Uh, was the first year for this style backhoe, the mighty backhoe. This one is actually an '89 specifically. Um, if you notice the wheel wells here are set back um, 
in 83, uh, well, up to 80, 83, up to 89, and actually all the previous versions, um, up to 88 was the last year actually that they were flush, flush with the end here, not set back like they are recessed. So, um, you know, uh, in 1990, uh, the cab style changed. It was a different shape and everything. So it had the same truck cab, but the backhoe cab was different. So we know that this one is, uh, like I said, flush wheel wells, um, hubs anyways, uh, ended in 1988. So you know that this one is in 89 because it has the recessed hubs and it still has the old style cab. So, and this works the same way. Um, you push out the push out the lever to to dig. Um, of course, this one uh, this one has grips on the upper part. The other, the original one, didn't have a grip at the at the top. It was just bare metal. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, this one, of course, it turns turns on the base. So, pretty cool. Truck. I had one like this as a kid. This one, uh, I got this one from the original owner actually. Um, ended up being my neighbor. <laughs> so he had it and uh, it was original from his childhood, 89. I got this in a, a T9 from him. A couple other miscellaneous things. But uh, yeah, so this one is the 89 version of the backhoe. Cool. And then of course, uh, this one. This one's a lot later version. This one's actually my son's. <laughs> he got it from uh, his great grandmother um, when he was when he was first born. Um, we got this uh, actually the year before he was born. Um, <laughs> they got gifts early, um, so this one is we got it in 2017. But um, this is one of the plastic frame versions, basically after. Forget uh, 99, I believe, is when they moved production to China and they began everything plastic. So this whole frame is plastic. The top top of the hood here, that's metal. Cab's metal. There's some metal parts underneath, but this top is plastic. That's metal. Um, but yeah, so this is actually when they switched over to the plastic frames, they started putting dates on them, but. The date isn't always the year that you bought it. Sometimes it's the year that it kind of began being made. So, I don't know, you never know. You can't really go by that. This one says 2013 on it. And like I said, we got it brand new from, uh, brand new in uh, 2017. So, yeah, so this is the newer version. Everything's pretty much plastic on it. It's all one piece, not a separate grill. All plastic. It's got some cool, cooler details on it. But this is the same style, kind of shape cab that they went with and beginning in 1990. That's why I said this one is a 89 because it has the old style backhoe cab and the recessed hubs, which began in 89. So, 89, 71, 89, and uh, middle to later 2010s. So, pretty cool. They all work the same way. The lever. The top lever pushes the stick out, curls the bucket. So, pretty cool. So that's the backhoe video. I've had some requests to do a backhoe video, and I finally pulled them out and got them cleaned up a little bit. I didn't go crazy. Like I said, this one's not this one's not perfect. It's got some chips on it, but lots of life still on it. That's for sure. Wiped it down with an armor all wipe quick. Cleaned it up pretty good. So, and that's going to do it for this video. So I appreciate you watching. Um, please hit the like and subscribe if you like my videos. Got a lot of support so far. We're at 89 as of this video. 89 subscribers, which is awesome. And we got over 24,000 views, which is so cool. Can't thank you enough for the support. And uh, that's going to do it. Hope to see you in the next video. And always be hunting. See you later.